Hello friends and subscribers, this is Prepper Princess. So today we are going to be making fried chicken. We've got greens and we're going to be making potatoes. I haven't decided which flavor yet. I'm going between smoky cheese bacon and the sour cream and chives, leaning to more towards the sour cream chives. These are pre-made, uh, not pre-made, sorry, um, pre-packaged and they're instant. So you pretty much just add water and it makes delicious, amazing potatoes. These are about 89 cents. You can get them just about anywhere. Um, very, very cheap. And it serves, I believe, three. So that's three servings right there. And I'm gonna teach you guys a quick little tip about chicken. Yes, I rinsed it. Yes, my hands are clean. And just so you guys know, I've gotten a lot of questions about this knife. It's a very good knife. I don't know where it came from. My ex-roommate left it and it doesn't have any sort of like made in China, made of Korea, so-and-so company. It's got no markings whatsoever, but it's very thick, very good to use. So chicken, this is something that you guys should keep in mind is that most people eat way more meat than what is supposed to be. This is $1.29 a pound. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this one chicken breast and I'm gonna cut it into two pieces. So it's gonna make two nice patties. This, will save on your meat consumption by about half. So if you, and it looks the same on a plate, you know, it, one half of a breast looks the same on the plate as long as you cut it correctly. All right, so we've got our nice chicken breast fillets. Oh, that one turned out messed up, but we can fix that. Or I can make that into, well, no, I'm, I can probably make that into a sandwich, but I cut it wrong because the camera was in the way, but this is how both sides should end up looking. And what I'm gonna do is just bread it in some of my Winco pre-made chicken bread, breaded stuff. And then you just put it in here, get it nice and breaded, very easy to do. This breading is, again, it's from Winco. It costs, I believe, like 89 cents a pound, so it's super cheap. I filled up a whole bag and it's gonna last a really long time. So you get it nice and done like that. Then we're just gonna take it over to this, which is, this is partially vegetable oil and partially butter. So it's gonna have a nice flavor to it. And then I'm breading the other ones right now. I'm also gonna be having, so I'm having mashed potatoes and I also am having some greens, but I like my greens raw. Um, so I've got some green beans here. And these are just gonna be eaten plain and raw. That's the way I like it. So I'm getting ready to do my workout, but I do have to eat first. I have to get some protein and energy in me before I'm able to do my Zumba. And this takes very little time, maybe, maybe 20 minutes tops. And yes, I was just washing my hands. You guys are really crazy about the hand washing and everything else. So while we have that going, we're gonna turn it down to medium. It's on medium high right now. Cameo, Rocky Cameo. Hi, mister. Okay, look out, look out. So in order to do this, we just take two cups of water and bring it to a boil. So I'm gonna be working on that. And also another thing that I'm going to be putting with the mashed potatoes is gravy. I always have my choice. These are not McCormick. I just kept the spice holders and I refill them with stuff that comes from the big bins at Winco, which are about, I wanna say about up to $2 a pound. So I'll, I'll usually buy like a third of a pound or a half a pound at time, fill these up. And then when I run low, I go and get more. So it's like super cheap. These, I think the McCormick go for like eight or nine bucks and refilling it for like a dollar or two is a lot better than nine bucks. So there's another quick tip. So cut your chicken breasts in half long ways, turn them into two different patties and get your gravy mix in bulk. All right, and we're back. We're getting ready to, I've boiled two cups of water and we're getting ready to add the sour cream and chives. It's just adding two cups of, adding this to two cups of boiling water. Very simple, takes very little time, maybe a minute. You just go in there. You don't even have to have it on the burner anymore. It'll thicken right up. Already getting thickened. And we already have perfect mashed potatoes. 
nice and thick, beautiful. We've got the thickened up gravy and we're still working on the chicken. But one of the things that I did want to mention to everyone is that when it comes to chicken, you all know that as Americans, we eat too much meat. I, fa I fall into that category too. I eat way more than I should. Technically, I should be eating half, half of this because it's supposed to be the size of your fist. So I should be eating half of one patty. I'm gonna be eating the full, the full one, but I should technically be eating only half of it. See how beautiful that looks? And when it comes to meat, you know, using less meat because it's one of the more expensive parts of the meal is that presentation is everything. So just by cutting that in half, I have doubled my meat, but it's going to look the same if you serve it to your family. And another thing is with meat, um, <clears throat> so this chicken breast was $1.29 a pound. Uh, when it gets to be a very low cost, you know, sometimes you'll see it for $2.99, $3.99, even four, five, six ninety nine dollars a pound. That's when you don't wanna buy it. When you buy it and it's on a super sale, $1.29 is not even the best. Um, come November and December, you can get them for 89 cents a pound. When that happens, you don't wanna go in and buy four or five pounds of it for 89 cents. You wanna go in and buy 20 or 25 pounds of it, put it in a vacuum sealer, put it in your freezer. Same thing goes with, with steak. Uh, I'm a really big steak eater. I like tri-tip and London broil to make beef jerky. When that goes on sale, it's usually you know $6.99, $7.99. When that goes on sale for $2.99 a pound, I go and I spend 50 to $60 at the store and I completely stock up my freezer. It's not only, and, and a lot of people will say, you know, we can't get chicken that cheap. Chicken is this cheap all over the United States. Uh, it just depends on where you buy it and when you buy it. That is key, it's absolutely key. When you buy it and where you buy it are absolutely paramount to saving money. All right, let's go have a bite. And we are back. I went ahead and let the food cool, cooled down a little bit. So I've got the instant mashed potatoes for 89 cents meant to serve two people. No, sorry, three people, three people. I've got the gravy that was, must cost maybe 10, 20 cents if you buy it in bulk. The green beans were 69 cents a pound with my produce delivery you can substitute with canned greens or corn on the cob corn whatever works for you the chicken was a dollar 29 a pound this is less than a half a pound it's a third of a pound so remember you know when i say a dollar meal i make more than one i will typically make more than one portion but at the same time it's less than a dollar per portion per person so let's start with the mashed potatoes and gravy. Get a nice big gravy thing on there. One more. More gravy, more gravy. Let's go with the chicken. Ooh. So here is the inside of the chicken breast, perfectly cooked. Still steaming, but not too hot. Mm.
So you can make your own breading for the chicken in order to make it fried chicken and you can do it yourself. This I think is amazing. It's from Winco and it's pre-made, but you can make it like from flour and spices. The one from Winco is a little bit bland, so I did add some garlic powder to it. So that made it a little bit better. And you guys won't be interested in me eating the green beans. It's all about the meat and the mashed potatoes and gravy. Mm. Best way you can save money is by cooking at home and the best way you can save money on food is proper proportions or por proper portions and presentation. Don't forget it not only matters where you buy but it also matters when you buy. Do which you can with what you've got, Prepper Princess out. A little after the video stuff for my real subscribers who stick around to the end. This is how I really eat. I talk with my mouth full. I have my hair pulled, pat, pulled back. Rocky's staring at me. We'll give some to Rocky. Come here, mister. Oh, yummy, yummy. You want another one? Oh, nom, 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 chicken.